the best in the world. Champion versus Champion contests is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, the WWE Champion, CM Punk. Punk's first tour of duty in WWE was epic. The pipe bomb set off an entirely new era in WWE. But oh, how times have changed since then. Yeah, when you think about the past accomplishments, Corey, CM Punk has been a WWE champion. He won Money in the Bank, so many other titles. But this current version of CM Punk is driven to surpass those past achievements. Punk possesses a lethal combination of fighting styles, and he's going to need it tonight. Yeah, no doubt about it. Punk is always ready for a fight, and he proclaims he is the measuring stick in this industry until someone proves him otherwise. Accompanied by Stephanie McMahon, representing the authority from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the WWE Champion, Seth Rollins. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. It's this simple for the champ. Win no matter what the stakes are. Seth Rollins is a superstar who watches all the angles. An architect who plans every move far in advance. He's out for himself and looking for any opportunity to further his own ambitions here in WWE. You make it sound so devious. Seth has just proven to be a brilliant tactician. He's found ways to play every situation to his advantage. There's no shame in looking out for number one. Well, when it comes to getting his way and making sure he comes out on top, Seth Rollins has become something of an expert. And then there's CM Punk, a man who is just as dangerous with a mic in his hand as he is in the ring. Yep, unquestionably one of the most controversial stars in this industry because of how he speaks his mind. Punk never holds back in anything he does. As far as Punk is concerned, no one is on his level, and he's ready to prove it. done. Mm -hmm. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. With a few years away from WWE, you have to think CM Punk has a bit of catch-up to play if he wants to get back on top. I wouldn't assume that, Cole. Punk wasn't sitting at home playing video games like a couch jockey. He kept in shape and kept fighting. Time away or not, he's still got what it takes to get it done in the ring. What are we about to own? Ah, crush a hamstring. Just never had a chance to block any of those. Single leg drop kick. 
Uh oh. Impressive reversal on Rollins. Hooked up. Oh, shit breaker. Hooked up and backdrop suplex. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. Seth retaliates. And he tosses him back in now. And wait a minute, what's the manager doing under the apron? Grabbing an item from under the ring is perfectly within the duties of being a manager. He's burying elbows in the midsection. stage getting visions of winding this battle down he is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad don't say that too loud saxon you might get caught shutting that down with the back elbow Oof. turned it into a jawbreaker look at this northern light suplex Cannot believe what I'm 
can't see it right now. No one can. And he scores a reversal on Rollins. Held in a perilous position. Right to the throat. Things now not going well for CM Punk. And Rollins is on a roll, gentlemen. This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. Sling blade! Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. Goodness gracious, got the knees up. CM Punk doing what he can to halter the beatdown. Time now for CM Punk to get his energy up and claw back into the fight. Oh. Versatility from Rollins. Super kick finds the mark. Seth Rollins taking charge in a big way. Punk needs to reformulate a strategy. The stomp in every single part of his body. Tagging this outside. This could be good. He's going for it all. Picks up the win. Here is your winner, Seth Rollins. CM Punk disappointed with this loss tonight. And Rollins is probably going to make sure we never hear the end of this. It's called taking pride in your success, Saxton. You wouldn't know anything about pride or success, though.